It's a multi-stakeholders security meeting in Abuja, jointly convened by the Nigeria Governors Forum and the Center for Democracy and Development. That comes to equity. The discussions center on the causes of insecurity in the country and how to prefer solutions to the problems. At our level at the CGD, we are engaged in research to discover what are the real dynamics of these uh, insecurity at the level of the grassroots. Lots of efforts, lots of ideas are being placed on the table. The Deputy Governor of Plateau State highlights some of the causes of insecurity in his state. The trust deficit between the various communities and between the communities and the government was a major threat to peace and security. And we felt we should address that first. And that was why we set up the peace building uh, agency. Rising insecurity across the country has recently given birth to a plethora of informal security networks. While some have commended these efforts to secure the communities, the increased shift of loyalty from the state security agencies to these informal security networks is now a source of concern. If loyalties of local communities and local people is shifting, these loyalties are shifting away from state and constitutionally recognized you know, security outfits to these local independent vigilante groups that they can deploy using their own local authorities. I think that is really a thing of concern. However, the chairman of the Nigeria Governors Forum has a different opinion on the informal security networks to secure communities. Security cannot be left in the hands of government. So if communities commit themselves to protecting themselves, ultimately uh, it's the way to go. Insecurity is a major problem in Nigeria and several meetings like this one have been held to brainstorm on solutions. As citizens hope that the outcomes will one day help the government through its agencies to address the problems once and for all.